On June 22nd, Jesuits Javier Campos and Joaquin Mora were murdered by a hitman for the Sinaloa cartel in the Tarahumara Mountains in northern Mexico. These two priests were very close to the people and able to speak the indigenous languages. A few minutes before they were killed, the same hitman also killed two lay people. The Jesuits in the region are asking the government for a response. There has to be some decisive, radical decision to put an end to the lawlessness. Because if not, this will continue in the same way. It will stay the same. As I said from the beginning, hugs are no longer enough to cover the bullets. They are not enough because there is too much death, too much persecution. There is too much impunity. Two days after the attack, Pope Francis prayed at his general audience for the victims. Sono vicino con l'affetto e la preghiera alla comunità cattolica colpita da questa tragedia. Ancora una volta ripeto che la violenza non risolve i problemi, ma cresce le inutili sofferenze. For us, it was really a moment of consolation. The Pope realizes what is happening to us, and above all, not only does he realize it, but he publicly expresses worldwide solidarity. The Pope's solidarity speaks to us as the Society of Jesus. For the time being, we are not leaving Tarama. The Jesuits are grateful for the support they have received from the government and the Mexican Episcopal Conference, in particular, the courageous communiques that were published calling for a response to the cartel violence. The Society of Jesus announced that they are not leaving the region. There, they have a hospital, two Jesuit parishes, and they celebrate Mass in a diocesan parish as well. Por lo pronto, no nos salimos de Tarama. For the time being, we are not leaving Tarahumara. Not at all. On the contrary, we are strengthening the workforce in Tarahumara. Our choice is them, and we can't run away at the first sound of gunfire. That is not the way for Christians, and much less for members of the Society of Jesus. We are still present here. They hope that the sacrifice of Javier Campos and Joaquin Mora will not be in vain. And they ask that with the collaboration of the church and the government, the cartels will soon disappear from Mexico. Good news from Rome Reports. This month, we reached 300,000 subscribers on our English YouTube channel. Thank you so much. If you are still not subscribed, you can do so by hitting the red button below.